Matapos sa mga balitaktakan, isinalang na sa botohan sa Kamara ang kontroversyal na Reproductive Health Bill. Inaasahang magpapamorningan na sa botohan ang mga mambabatas at live mula sa batas ng pambansa. Saksi si Jamie Santos. Jamie? Vicky Arnold sa mga oras na ito, nasa 54 na mga kongresistang bumuboto pabor sa RH Bill habang nasa 41 naman ang bumuboto ang kontra rito. All those in favor for the approval of House Bill 4244 on second reading, please say aye. All those against the approval of House Bill 4244, please say nay. Obviously, the crowd in the back joined the Quran. The eyes have it. Sa kabila ng pagtutol ng ilan, nasa ilalim sa botohan sa pamamagitan ng Viva Voce o palakasan ng boses, ang kontrobersyal na Reproductive Health Bill mag-aalas 8 ngayong gabi. Bilang presiding officer, sinabi ni Dandy Deputy Speaker Erin Tanyada na mas malakas ang boto ng mga ayos o pabor sa panukala. Pero maagap si na votas Representative Toby Tianco at isinulong na mag-nominal voting o yung paisa-isang boto na may kaakibat na pangpaliwanag. Natuloy ito matapos katiga ng apat na putimang kongresista, sapat sa kinakailangan one-fifth na dalawang daan at dalawang put-anim na dumalong kongresista. Sa labas naman ng kongreso, handa rin sumabay sa pamorningan ng mga kongresista ang mga pro at anti-RH. Narito ang pahayag ng ilan sa mga nakaboto na. It is a great regret that I cannot request To the wish of my party that we vote for this bill, the President says that this is a conscience vote, and I believe him, and I support him in that stand. But I am also a father, more than even a legislator, and I want my children to grow up in a society where they will know what responsibilities, including sexual freedom, should entail and not just be something that will be enjoyed without its concurrent, concomitant duties. So therefore, Mr. Speaker, I vote very definitely. And I offer this vote to Our Lady of the Immaculate Conception, to Our Lady of Kaisasai, and to Our Lady of Guadalupe that we celebrate today. I vote a resounding no, Mr. Speaker. The RH Bill is not about our own religion. It is about the obligation of the state to its citizens, regardless of religion. And I believe that the state has the absolute obligation to protect and respect a broad spectrum of reproductive health rights for every citizen. I vote yes for this bill because it affirms life, it upholds choice, and it underscored responsibility. Sa mga oras ito, Arnold Vicky, tinatayang nasa isang daang pa lang na mambabatas ang bumuboto pabor at kontra RH Bill. Tinatayang aabuti na to ng magmamadaling araw ngayon. Live mula rito sa kamara, ako si Jamie Santos, sang inyong saksi.